former top political advisor, Ling Jiwa gets life sentence for graft. Beijing, a former deputy head of China's top government advisory body was imprisoned for life for bribery, illegally accessing state secrets and abusing power by a court in the eastern city of Tianjin on July 4. Ling Jiwa, a former vice chairman of the Chinese People's Political Consultative Conference, CPPCEC, was tried in a closed-door hearing that began on June 7, state-run Xinhua News Agency reported. Ling was charged with taking over 77 million yuan in kickbacks on multiple occasions either alone, with his wife Galiping or through his son Lingu, Xinhua said. In return, he helped his associates get promoted. Officials who benefited through their links to Ling includes Li Chunqing, a former vice governor of the southwestern province of Sichuan, who was sentenced to 13 years in prison for graft in October 2015. Prosecutors also charged Ling with illegally accessing large amounts of classified documents when he served in the ruling Communist Party's United Front Work Department in 2012 which liaises with the other eight registered political parties in the country, and during his stint as the vice chairman of the CPPCEC from 2013 to 2014. The court did not say whether Ling had leaked state secrets. Ling, 59, was put under investigation by the party's anti-graft watchdog, the Central Commission for Discipline Inspection, in late 2014 several months after they started probing into the dealings of two of his brothers, Ling Zengs, the former vice chairman of the political advisory body in the northern province of Shaanxi and Ling Wanqing, a businessman. Ling Wanqing has fled to the United States, international media reported. Party investigators handed Ling Ju over to prosecutors for a criminal investigation in July 2015. He was formally charged in May. Ling whose personal assets have been confiscated by the Tangent Court, said he would not appeal the sentence.